He's dead. The nigga is dead. Because of me. So I was talking to this little dude. We was talking when I was hella young. Like he was like low key my first love or whatever. One day he had gave me his account password and he had logged me out. But I had like my email and number on it. So I logged back in. And I seen all the bitches he was texting. Mind you, he lived down the street from me. So I was like going at it with myself, you know, just find my demons. And I told my brothers. And my brothers, they wasn't tripping off that. So I was like, I need to find a better lie. After I told my brothers, I had walked to his house and I had cussed out his mama. Mind you, his mama didn't understand nothing because this was my first boyfriend. He was missing. His mama spoke Spanish only. So I'm sitting there cussing her out. He has a lot of brothers and he, they had kicked me out the house. So I walked back, beat myself up. I had a black eye because of myself and told my brothers he did it. Because why would why would you do that? And this is a true story too. And his name, Isaac Larambe. Long live that boy. <laughs> But not. Nah. told his brothers and what did your brothers do? Oh, I told my brothers they had went back over there. His brothers go at it with my brothers and boom. But free my brother though. Your brother shot him. Yes. The case is over with. <laughs> How many years did your brother get? 25. But my brother don't know that I'll be myself up. To this day? No. The only person I know.